Hey guys, so today I am back with Nev. Look at her, just look at her. We have been filmed together since literally September and you guys were asking where she was and I was like, I've, I was okay. alive. Yeah, no, she's alive. Been alive. She's been alive this whole time. And so I was like, Nev, you slept over at my house last night. Don't leave at 9 a.m. You have to stay here and film with me. So she did. And today we are filming another Q&A, a a q and a with my breast friend, Nevin number two. And so here she is, my breast friend. We are going to be answering you guys' questions. And I told you guys to tweet me with the hashtag AskBreast. And we're getting a lot of questions. So we're gonna go ahead and get into this one. Andrea asks, what's your favorite place to go eat together? Uh, Chipotle, or Chipotle, as you call it. Yeah. Chipotle. Chipotle. That's how she pronounces Chipotle. That's I, not I literally it. thought that's what it was up until like a month ago. Oh no, you used to get so angry at no, me I when don't. I would be I would be like, I no, mean, like, I was it's convinced. Chipotle. I was convinced that's what it was. She'd be but... like, okay, okay, Megan. <laughs> All right, well. Or like maybe mellow mushroom or something. Oh yeah, that's our, that's our shit right there. Please Justin asks, who can pull the ugliest face? Probably me. Probably Nevin. <laughs> it's definitely me, so. <laughs> you look like a carrot, like an actual carrot when you do that. Easton asks, why is her name Nevin if she isn't a baby? Hashtag ask breast. Uh, I don't know. I mean, it's always been really weird, but I mean, I just like go along with it. Like, it's really not a normal name for, like, a teenager like me, but it's fine. Her parents wanted to originally name her it because they knew that she was going to be an adult-sized baby, and I think that's why the name, like, kind of stuck, and it's just been Nevin ever since, right? Yeah. If I had a dollar for every time one of you ding holes asked us how we met, go watch our last Q&A together because I'm pretty sure we answered it in that. We answered it in our best friend yeah. tag. We answer it multiple times. Don't ask me that anymore. We've already told the damn story. We met at school. Freshman year. Together. Forever. Ever since. It's love. Love at first sight. Lust. Sexuality. Riley asks, most rebellious thing you've ever done together? We got kicked out of the mall. Freshman year? When we filmed that YOLO video, we, we literally got kicked out of the mall three times and they were like, like, you need to leave. And we just like didn't leave. They were so rude They were really rude to us. Like they actually thought these two like 14 year old girls in morph suits were gonna like rob a store and like hurt someone. And we were just like, okay. <laughs> And then we're gone. We're going to Target. And then we left. But they, like, followed us out, and they're like, where are you going? Yeah, no, like, they followed us out to our like, cars to, like, make sure that like, we got the car. harassing us. And, like, I just don't even understand. Maddie asks, do you wombo? Um, I wombo. You, I, you yeah, wombo? I usually wombo, too. He, she, Her mom does wombo. sometimes. My dogs wombo. Yeah. Most of my family wombos. Sometimes we get, like, our families together. And we all like wombo together. Yeah, like a gathering and we'll just like do it together. I think that's that's like the most fun way to do yeah, it. Yeah, I love wamboing like with all of our families together because I feel like like when your grandma gets into it, that's like the best part of the whole entire like wamboing. Like, do you know what I mean though? Yeah. Abby asks, which armpit do you shave first? I normally shave my left one first. Just because, you know, right-handed, like it just goes, it just, it works. I mean, I normally don't do that, so. Shave? What? Terry on P face asks, do you have plans for Valentine's Day? Um, do we look like we have plans <laughs> for Valentine's Day? <laughs> Please look at what we're doing right now. Do you think we have any kind of significant other? No. I can honestly say, like, I don't think I've ever done anything for Valentine's Day in my entire life. The hottest Valentine's Day date I've ever had was with my sister last year when we went to Olive Garden. Hannah asks, do you have a song that reminds you of each other? Do you have any plans to travel together? The Goofy Goober theme song is usually the one. Um, I'd say what reminds me of you is... I'm Good by Tory Lanez. Yeah. Callisto by etc. etc. Oh, I forgot about that one. Wow, these are some nice ones. Throwing it back. Throwing it back. <laughs> kind of like I Am Who I Am in parentheses Killing Time by Mac Miller because I remember over the summer when I first started becoming obsessed with it, I would be like, Nevin, I love this song so much. Yeah, I was gonna say any like Mac Miller song. Yeah, because we went to that concert together and it was really fun. Or like Odd Future song. Anything that makes you want to like start a riot. Or usually. like punch someone in the face. Yeah. We normally punch each other in the face when we're listening to it. Yeah, it usually just reminds you of Megan, so. And do we have any plans to travel together? I mean, like when we're older and can kind of like afford that. Yeah, I mean, that, we like... both are like on route to LA. Like yeah. that's really like where we both want to be. 
but I'm like scared of traveling and Megan's not, so. Yeah, I mean, we, we traveled together before she went to LA at the same time that I did. Yeah. That was nice. But I mean, like maybe in the near future. Jasmine asks, most embarrassing moment in front of a guy in parentheses besides throwing up. Frig off, okay? And then she also asks, how are you guys liking the snow here in Georgia? Ask breast. <laughs> okay, well one, if you guys saw our anti-boyfriend tag, we talked about this group of guys at our school. That who, we were really attracted to. Yeah, I mean, we're friends with them now, so it's like really embarrassing because they saw the video. And, and like, they watched it. They <laughs> knew we were talking about them. Yeah, and so. like, I mean, I heard from other people that they had like found the video and then last night we were with them and one of the guys was like, so... Heard you mentioned us in a video, <laughs> and I literally looked at him and I go, uh, I, uh, I, I, uh, I, uh, 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 yeah. See ya. <laughs> and then I just went home. I just walked home. <laughs> no, but I was just like, uh, yeah, I did that or something, and he was just like, like, he didn't, he didn't say <laughs> um. So yeah, that's pretty embarrassing that, like, they know that we just think that they're really attractive and, like. I mean, it I wasn't mean, whatever. Even... They should be really thankful. Yeah, they should be thankful that they that we were saying that. Okay, you're welcome. At least we weren't saying really creepy things. It wasn't that creepy. But I think that's why it was the most embarrassing part because we didn't want them to think that we were creepy. We were just like admiring them. We weren't being creepy. I look like Justin Bieber. <laughs> and then she also asked, "How are you guys liking the snow here in Georgia?" And um, I don't like it at all. Yeah, no, I, I really don't like it. I'm... I don't like not being able to leave my house and being stuck here with my parents. Like it's really not fun. Yeah really not enjoyable and like it's still snowing right now. The road in front of my house is completely frozen over and like I bet if I tried to drive I would just get into it. Trapped in my house with my parents. <laughs> okay well that was our Q&A for you all. If your question did not get answered make sure to stay tuned and follow me on Twitter at Miss Mega Makeup so that you can be involved in these next ones. And thank you all for asking questions with the hashtag AskBreast. I thought I am really funny, so that's why I did that. And I hope that you guys enjoyed seeing Nev again since September. It's been a while. Yeah. So here she is. She is alive. Don't worry. And she died and cut her hair if you didn't know that. So I just want to say thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you in my next video. Bye. <laughs> And today we are filming. What are we filming? What are we filming again? L. <laughs> I look like a mushroom. <laughs> <laughs> that's like the best one that you do. I think that's the best one that that's you like do. That's like the only like... one I do. Ow, that just gave me heartburn doing that. Like my you, you my throw chest your neck out. my chest. <laughs> No, like my chest just caved in and like I'm in pain. No, the best one that you do is when you make the noise with it too and it's just like a weird, like you don't know what animal it is, but like it could be something. Doing that like actually it. just made me lightheaded. Like I have a headache. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And like I think that's why the name kind of <laughs> got with Nice. Look at my hand. My hair <laughs> during the last one was literally like this. <laughs> like a puff. Look on at the mine side. now. I've never been to Fell off. <laughs> I'm good like G double O D O G Kush by the motherfucking O Z hoes wanna roll with a young nigga so street fucking sorry let you try and hit the whole team fucking she a groupie stuntin' nigga we do beat